Ladies and gentlemen, from the Paramount here in Huntington, New York, we are set to go with our next bout of the evening, and it's all being brought to you courtesy of Joe DeGuardia's Star Boxing. At the sound of the bell, your third man in the ring, Pat Sullivan. And now, ladies and gentlemen, four rounds of boxing scheduled in the heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, he wears the black with gold. He weighed in at 213.8 pounds. His professional record, a perfect one. Six fights, six victories, all six wins coming by way of knockout. From Ocala, Florida, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome James, the Sledge Hammer Tree. Hammer Tree. And his opponent across the ring fighting out of the red corner. He wears white and gold. He weighed in at already 233.4 pounds. His professional record, also a perfect one. Four fights, four victories, three of them coming by way of knockout. From the Bronx, New York, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Gentleman George Arias. Arias. Hey. All right, fighters, you've been given an instruction to the dressing room, right? Three things I say, respect the sport, respect the rules, and show respect for each other. Protect yourself at all times, at all times, all right? Touch the bell, touch the gloves, come out, bell fighting. And we got to keep our eye on this, Randy. we got to keep our eye on this one, Randy, because these guys are big bangers. They're a lot of confidence. Looks like in these guys, and they've all got all but nothing but knockouts and wins. And the so, man fighting in the black trunks with the yellow waistband, one of our favorite last names, Hammertree. James Hammertree against George Arias. And Jerry, you're right. Heavyweights, especially in the first round, when they got 100% of their gas in the tank. And Arias looks a little bit out there. <laughs> No question that they're both strong, Jerry. I think there's a little what I call chunk on the trunk of Arias. I think he's got a lot of skill. He's got a lot of talent. Looks like Joe Frazier a little bit, right? Weaving underneath there, working that body. Big, strong guys. Let's see if they, either one throws many more than one or two jabs in I the round. But Jerry, they're toe-to-toe. -to -toe. And I think Hammertree's never ran into somebody like this. This guy's working some great body shots. Looks like Joe Frazier. Throwing punches like Joe Frazier. Nice left hook by Arias. He's moving in. Can he sustain this for a long period of time? We don't know, but he's working some great body shots of Hammertree. This one is scheduled for four rounds. Do not leave your seats. Don't get a, go get a drink. Don't go to the refrigerator. These guys are on each other from the opening bell. George Arias in the white trunks, James Hammertree in the black trunks. A nice right uppercut by James Hammertree. But oh, Ari that left hook and then a right hand by Arias. Arias is swarming him. Another left hook by Arias. Hammertree comes right back. And they bull into each other. Jerry, that could have easily been a head bump. They've been banging heads a little bit so far. I think Hammer Tree's a little bit more green than Arius. Uh. Well, Jerry, we've talked about feeling out rounds, and we've seen plenty of them. We got none here this tonight. This is not one of them. Now, you see Hammer Tree's leading with his head. His head is wide open, his hands are down. Very bad in the heavyweight division, in any division, but these are two rookie, kid rookie guys, and uh, Hammertree is, uh, is going to be careful he's going to get hit with a nice overhand right or left hook. So when you said his head is down, you mean in close, he's looking down at the floor? No, it, it, you see his hands are down right now, his hands are low, oh, so his face his is head wide is open. Down. Okay. But his head is up in the air, looking up with oh. nothing, no cover, no cover. Yeah, you never, as a trainer, want to see a guy with his chin up in the air. Final 20 seconds of the opening round. Heavyweight bout. James Adias in the white. George Adias in the white. 
James Hammertree in the dark trunks yellow waistband. I have to give the round to Arias, but uh, Hammertree's coming back. Final second, opening round, don't go away. This one is electric all the way. Wow. And Jerry, right from the opening bell, let's take a look at the replay here. These guys have been on each other. And they sure have, Randy. They've been banging from pillar to post. These guys are fighting. Nice right hand by Arias. Hammertree came up with a nice uppercut there. And they're putting a lot of pressure on, a lot of steam. And for these rookie guys, can their endurance hold up? That's what we got to see. Nice right hands by both these guys. Exciting first round. Here we go. Start of round number two. Joe DeGuardia's star boxing rock and fights 22. We got a heavyweight bout. George Arias in the white. James Hammertree in the black trunks, yellow waistband. It was a close first round, action first round. Both of us thought, thought that Arias won that But round. Hammertree was coming on towards the end of the first round, and it looks like he's continuing it in the second round here. Jerry, nice jab. You used the word before, conditioning. I mean, these guys can easily, and it happens with heavyweights more so than others because the muscles are so heavy, they run out of gas. They punch themselves right out. And the excitement. I wonder, and the excitement, you, you outpunch yourself, you gotta pace yourself. I always tell the guys, save some for the last round. George Arias from right here in the Bronx. Nice right hand by Arias. Hammer tree from Ocala, Florida. What a name, Hammer tree. I love that name for a fight. And a couple of guys, there's nice, great body shots by Arias. Great pot, nice uppercut. Nice hook by Hammertree. Nice combination, Howard. Hammertree's coming right back. Wow, what, what, what power punch is being thrown here tonight? Arias loading up on his shots, takes a few to the head as he comes oh, in. Nice oh, hook. nice hook by Arias. And here's where Arias got to be careful not to outpunch himself. He's throwing some big haymakers in there. Big haymakers, but he's missing a lot of them it now. Just takes Hammertree is coming back. Hammertree is coming back. And Hammertree holds Arias is winded. Arias is winded. Still over a minute to go in round number two, scheduled for four. But I like what Arias is doing. He's working the body very well. He's getting inside, then he's coming over the top. You got to give it to Hammertree. He's a tough kid. Referee Pat Sullivan almost jumped in for a count. Hammertree is doing a smart thing. He's holding on. He hit with a nice right hand there by Arias. Do you think he's hurt, Jerry? I do think he's, he's tired and hurt. Nice right hand by Hammertree. Whoa! They are just loading it up. This is the golden gloves. This is unbelievable. What a great, great competitive fight here. And Jerry, Again. conditioning is going to tell, like you said. You better believe it. we got a couple more rounds. Only, thank God they're only going four. Another great matchup by uh, Ron Katz Ron did Katz. it again. Thank God that Hammertree's weaving pretty good on there. He's not getting caught with all those big fights. He's coming right back. As we head to the final 10 seconds of the second round, you're going to hear the rap on the ring with five seconds to go. Round number two, put it in the books. Here the bombs in wow. round number two. These guys are just unbelievable. The shots they're taking and they're absorbing and they're giving back. And thank God Hammertree is bobbing and weaving pretty good. Not there in this couple of punches, but he's standing up to it. And listen, this Arias is a great puncher. A lot of knockouts on his record. Look at him, he's standing up well. He got banged there a little bit, but he did not fall on his floor. He almost went down. You know what's crazy? Stop trading. You're too fast for him. Make your pivots now. Give me this. Here's where the real man comes up. He's saying you gotta stay up there, keep them hands up, and you gotta bang the body, you gotta fire back and step off. Don't stay in front of this guy. This guy's a tremendous puncher. Jerry, you saw 
Arias at the end of the second round with his hands on the rope, sitting down. Do you like that or does it matter to you? No, I think it's good to have your hands down, down, let the blood flow uh, to revive yourself. I mean, you got the oxygen going through your body. But here comes uh, Hammer Tree is, is firing back. I've given the first two rounds to George Arias. Jerry, how do you see it? I saw it the same way. I mean, he's just throwing some devastating body shots, opening up Hammer Tree for the upstairs, and he's been connecting. But Hammer Tree's hanging in there. He's firing back. Two tough guys. Nice. Oh! Tremendous right hand. That was possibly the best fight of punch of the night by George Arias. And Hammer Tree took it well right on the cheek. And Arias looks a little bit tired. He's not, not putting the pressure on as much anymore. And now he's on the rope for the first time. And they take a respectful breather. This time they're not on each other. They and, let and, each other take the breather. Right, and obviously you see the more talented of the two fighters is Arias. He's got a lot more ability. He's a pretty strong little puncher. The other guy, listen, Hamatree's got a lot of guts, but he's absorbing a lot of punishment. And firing back. This is round number three of a heavyweight bout. George Arias in the white trunks, James Hammertree in the black. And here's where they start to say I should have ran a little bit more in the preparation for this fight, but two tough guys. Nice right hand by both exchange. And Jerry, it's very true. If they haven't done their homework, like nice left home, hook. That's by where Arias. The, the doubt creeps in, right? Well, yeah, I mean, if, you, if, you, if you're not in shape, you're thinking about it, and especially this young in your career, you worry about the fight. This can happen, that can happen. You get tired before you get in there. And then you, you absorb some of these shots, and you just thought, wow, you, you feel like you're behind, you got to catch up. Under one minute to go. Nice left hand by Hammertree and a hook by Arias. And Jerry, in the fights that Hammer Tree is hot, and he's had six fights. He won his first fight, a second round knockout. In all the rest of his fights, he's won on first yeah, round that's knockout. That's a very, very he, bad. He is learning tonight. And he's in with a tough guy, a good puncher. He's got a lot of guts. Look at him, he's got that rope a dope, he's running around. Nice like move Muhammad by Ali. Looks a little bit like Muhammad Ali. He's got a mix of Muhammad Ali and Joe Frazier. <laughs> Trying to impress the judges with a little bit of boxing right now. Final seconds, round number three. <laughs> Jerry, action from round number three. And another sensational fight. You got to give it to Mr. Arias. He's just bobbing and weaving on side. Left, nice left hook to the head. Right there, um, listen, Hammertree's hanging in there, but he's not able to. And let's go to the corner of James Hammertree. So this is time now. There's no more tomorrow. No more tomorrow. I'm letting him go. I'm letting him go. Okay. Three Testing. minutes. I can do anything for three minutes. Testing now for three minutes. When you come down, bend your knees and come with the upper cut on the yes, hook. Okay? Yes, sir. Hey. Hold it. How am I doing? Of course you're gonna do it. <laughs> He's saying, boy, you gotta go out there and fight, fight hard to win this round to get to get this decision. And uh, unfortunately, he's in there with a tough guy. You saw it, uh, Arias moving around. The, the ring gentlemanship he just showed there is how fighters win, win, win the round. He, he, he won the round fully, that last round three. It's three nothing. I see it in my book, Randy. You? And yes, I've got a three nothing also. But if that last round for some reason should have been closer, if it should have gone to Hammer Tree, then if Hammer Tree wins this round, it could be a draw. So let's see what happens, how hard Hammer Tree can break. Now you see Hammer Tree's hands are way down. He's getting killed with those haymakers of Arias. You got to keep the hands up. You just got to keep the hands up. His hands are way down low. Jerry, this is one of those fights where I always like to say, I don't know how much they're getting paid, but it's not it's enough. Not enough. Right. Hammer Tree's fighting back with his hands are way too low. And listen, Arias is throwing the haymakers. He's got a lot of skills, he's a good athlete, and he's uh, taking the fight to him. He's catching with those large, solid shots. 
And veteran referee Pat Round Sullivan up. doing a nice job letting them work on the inside, work their way out of it. And surprisingly, there really hasn't been many clinches like you see there. And the referee had to break them on that one. Well, we've seen a lot from Arias. He, he can come in, give you the Joe Frazier style, or he can move around with like Ali did. So he's got some, some talent. He's uh, not that young of a guy, but he's, he's uh, in a good game. I think he's going to go someplace. Well, Jerry, he's thrown all those haymakers at the head. Would you like to see him bring those shots down to well, the Well, he body? does, and he does at times. He, you know, he does it to, to end it around. He's trying to get a knockout here. But I agree, you got to bang the body. The hands come down. But this guy's hands are down anyway, wide open. But they're both two very tough guys. It's an exciting fight for the fans. We just passed the midway point of the fourth and final round. Those short hooks all aimed to the head by George Arias. He's absorbing too much how much he is. He's trying. What an entertaining fight this has been, Jerry. But this round, I think Hammertree, you see a lot of the power coming off his shots as we are under one minute to go in the fight. Nice exchange of punches there. Unfortunately, Arias is one landing the more, the more, more devastating punches. It's funny, there's a big screen behind us, and Hammertree just looked up to kind of watch the fight. Yeah, let's watch himself. Nice jab by Hammertree. Nice body shots by Arias. Nice bobbing and weaving. I like it. I like the action. Nice right hand by Arias. And he's walked into a corner. I think that one hurt Hammertree. About 15 seconds to go. He's looking for his corner for help, Hammertree is, and it's a little too late for that. Final seconds of the fight. Here's the wrap. Five seconds and under. Nice right hand by Put this Arias. In the nice book. hook. We just saw here a Joe Guardia star boxing rocket fight. 22 for the Paramount Theater in Huntington, New York. We'll be back with the decision in just a moment. Welcome back to the Paramount Theater in Huntington, Long Island, New York, to Joe DeGuardia, Star Fox and Rock and Fights 28, waiting for the decision on this four-round heavyweight bout. Let's go up to ring announcer David Diamante. Ladies and gentlemen, after four rounds of action here at the Paramount, we go to the judges' scorecards. All three judges scored this bout identically, 40 to 36, all for your winner by unanimous decision. From the Bronx, New York, gentlemen, George Arias. You know, Randy, this guy's got some personality, George Arias, from the Bronx. A lot of personality. No question about it. A very happy winner. And I think he learned a lot from this fight. I think Gene Hammertree also learned a lot from it. And there you go. This kid's got some personality, this George Arias. We're going to see a lot of fun things with him. I hope he stays in the game and develops. And the other kid is going to nothing to be ashamed about. He fought his ass off. He worked hard. And uh, he's got to go back to the drawing board. No question about it. And who knows, Jerry, the way the heavyweight division is, and this, this is entertaining, but George Arias wins it on a unanimous decision. Now, 5-0 and oh with three knockouts. We'll be back with more. Joe DeGuardia's star boxing 
Rockin' Fights 22.